Hey everyone, Tracy here bringing you another TradingView tutorial. Before we get started, just a reminder that if you find value in what I'm doing, please hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and don't forget to hit the notification bell. Let's get started. All right, so in this video, what I wanna go over is how to sync up some of your drawings on a chart. So let's say that you're working in an individual chart like this, and you've got the single layout like I have right here. And you'll know that or you have access to the layout, the chart layout right up in the top right hand corner, uh, just a little bit over. You can see it right here. It says select layout. When you click on that, you can see that I've got an individual chart selected. So now let's say that you select some horizontal lines. You do some analysis. You, you throw some of this in. Let's say you throw a fib on your chart. Maybe you've got a trade underway. So you've got a long position and let's just say you're sitting right there and you're looking to do this. So you've done all your analysis, you've created something and it's on your chart. Now you've decided that, you know what, I want to look at this on multi time frames, or I want to take a look at multiple charts with these drawings. So what you do is you go over to the multi chart and then you select say four charts in a row. And wouldn't you know it, you take a look here and all your artwork, all of the stuff that you've drawn on your charts, all the work that you did is only available on the one chart, right? So I'm going to show you, first of all, how you can prevent that from happening. But the first thing I want to do is if you run into this problem, what you can do is select this chart, go over to the object tree, which is on the right hand side. And now what we're going to do is select all of these tools that we have. So we've got the long position, the fib, the horizontal lines, we can just select the first one, go down to the bottom with the shift button and select the bottom one. It'll select all of them. Now what you do is right click on that, go down to no sync and then go to sync to charts. Okay. And notice how it added it to all of the charts. Now all, all your drawings are synced to all of the chart, the entire chart book now. Right? So that's one way of solving it. Now the next way of solving it, let's just delete all of those. Let's go back to a single chart. And let's say that you have your chart open, go to that select chart layout and make sure that drawings is selected. First of all, now what we'll do is we'll, we'll put some line, lines on our chart and let's throw a fib on here we'll just throw it anywhere. And let's throw a long position. Let's say it's over here. Okay. And now what we're going to do is we're going to go back to the select layout and go down to a multi layout and look at that. All of the drawings are on that multi layout. So there's two ways of handling the drawings on your charts. One of them is to show you a quick and easy way of copying from one chart to the next. And then the other one is uh, to prevent that from happening. So it shows up on your charts at all times. All right, let's delete that and happy trading everybody. If you found value in this video, please remember to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and don't forget to hit the notification bell till next time.